Hey there. So if you take a look at this page, it probably looks familiar. If you've ever used WooCommerce, you know that WooCommerce comes with a My Account page. And on the My Account page, you have things like orders and memberships and the stuff that you normally get when you're buying stuff, the addresses, payment methods, account details, all that kind of stuff. Now, I'm using a special plugin that gives me payment plans. That's different. It's a little different than subscriptions, but you'll notice this thing right here, which is courses courses. How did that get there? That's not a normal part of stuff. And when I click on courses, what do I get? I get a, this is a screen that's designed by LearnDash. This shows you what courses you're enrolled in, how many you've completed, certificates and points you've made, shows your photo, your pro name and profile, and it gives you a quick access into these courses. How did this get here? Because I put it there. I used a learn dash short code and I put it into this area in this space. And you're going, wait, okay, how'd you do all that? Let me show you. It's three little snippets, three snippets of code. Now, if you say, hey, I'm not a programmer. I don't know how to do this. Not a problem at all. So the first courses endpoint, what we want is to create in the WooCommerce space, we wanna create an endpoint that says, hey, um, just like you go to something like my account, I want you to be able to go to courses and I want that courses to be part of the, my account. So the first thing I got to do is create the endpoint, which says courses. This is where we're going to do something special. The second one is I want to put that endpoint into the, my account section. And the third is inside when you click courses, I want to put that learn dash short code. Now look at what this is. This is just code. Okay, and when we look at the code, you're gonna go, wait, I don't, I don't know how to do any of that. Not a problem, because I'm gonna give it to you, right? But you go there, that's the, it's a little bit of code over here, right? What about adding that new endpoint? Okay, another little bit of code. You go, okay, that's not the end of the world, but yes, there is some code. And then create the account page. This is the, even the smallest amount of code, because it says, do this short code, and it's the learn dash profile. That's all we're doing. And you go, okay, Chris, how do, I, how do I get this? Well, let me show you. This is a plugin called Snippets, right? Snippets, it is what it sounds like. You can drop in little snippets of code. So here we have snippets. I have three of these that have turned active and notice this little import. I can give you a little file and you download the file and when you hit import and you give it the file, it'll load these three guys into your account. That easy. Now I got a team that's working on building a little plugin for this so that if you're a LearnDash customer and you want that tight integration with WooCommerce, you can get it that way too, okay? But the point is I'm gonna give you all this code so you don't have to worry about it. And as a result, when you come, when, when your customers who bought courses come to their My Account section in WooCommerce, you'll see courses, you'll see all the courses they're enrolled in, it's automatic, it's right there, it'll be awesome.